Hello everyone, Toasted Baby here with a quick update video for ye. If you notice, I am on Minecraft 1.7.4, and if we go into multiplayer, we can see that the Toasted Craft fan server, it, oh, it's pinging. Well, it, it's up, so let's go ahead and join. And here we are. Oh, wow, left, you have died quite a few times, I have to say. But anyway, so uh, yeah, you can now get on, oh, come on, load chunks. Let's go ahead and just, uh, there we go, we'll just reload the chunks. Okay, so, um, yeah, so the Toasted Craft fan server is now on 1.7. 1. Um, 1. It's on 1.7.2, but that is compatible with 1.7.4, so it has all the built-in live streaming and stuff, all the other features that you've known to come and love. Uh, you will, of course, spawn into Spawn, which is now this festive Christmas theme, thanks to, I don't know, Akira or somebody. They decided to make a Christmas theme on the server. So, uh, yeah, you go ahead and welcome or come back to spawn. And actually, we'll just go ahead and do this. There are a couple new features. There we go. A couple new features that come along with this update. Uh, one, I have released an updated version on my texture pack, which now has emeralds back in the game. Uh, so there's no more amethyst because I don't have a reason to have amethyst back in the game. And it was just a little too confusing. So I just put these back in that. So... Yeah. Oh, no, don't go over there. No, come, come back. There we go. Okay. There we go. So, yeah, it's just, it's just, it's the same texture, but green. And then this might change it because it's a little too green. So, yeah, that is all that there. Oh, look. Hello, Akira. I totally wasn't talking about you right there. Yeah. And it's also might be a little bit laggy for the first day or so because of the next feature, which I'm going to show you. Shift delete. Okay, that doesn't work. All right. But uh, anyway, let's just get rid of those. Um,. Oh, they're going to... Oh, no. Stop that. Oh, right, I'm vanished. Whoopsie. Or no, unvanished. I don't know. Okay, well, yeah, there's going to be lag on the server because uh, I have DyneMap installed once again. So, uh, yeah, we'll just go over that in a minute. But uh, go ahead, feel free to explore all the different land. Uh, people didn't listen when I told them when I reset the server to not go out far. So, uh, good luck trying to find land, but there is something to help. Uh, so we are going to go ahead and head over to Dynamap. If we actually, if you look right here, right when you log in, you get this nice message. You won't get this whole stuff, but it'll say, welcome your name, who's on. And then right here, live server map is available at toastedcraft.net, uh, colon 8123. So we're going to go ahead and head over there and see what that is. All right, guys, welcome to Dynamap. You just open this up in your browser, and for the URL, you do toastedcraft.net colon 8123, and then up comes this map. This is a full map of the entire Toasted Craft server. Oh, well, it's going to be. Um, I'm current, there, the plugin is currently working on doing a full 3D render of the entire map, so it's going to take quite a while to do. Um, but this is what it has so far, so you can use this to look for new biomes. I know, so uh, if we go down, actually over here, there's a... Uh, good place for looking for new biomes. So if, as you can see, all the big oceans are now gone. This is from 1.6 generation. This is all 1.7 right here. So this is what you can expect from the new land generation. Small rivers in between, no more oceans. It's very, very nice. So, and of course, there's going to be this uh, chunk generation error, as you see right here, but that's just going to, that's just to be expected with the uh, new generation interfering with the old generation. So you can use this to find different biomes. As you can see, the savanna, desert, uh, dark oak forest right here, blah, blah, blah. If someone finds a mesa, you can go ahead and see it. I think there is one down here. I'm going to give it away. I think this is a mesa. Um, so yeah. And then it has the uh, coordinates on the left-hand screen, wherever your cursor is. You can go ahead and do that. Also, if you log into the server and then uh, come on to here, then you can go ahead and type in the chat and say, oh, no. Go away. There we go. So you can, oh, no, god damn it. There is the chat. No, stop it. There's a little chat thing down here. You just type into that. It's those stupid icons. So you can go ahead and type in the chat. You can see that there are people typing here. You can see it has little chat bubbles for who's talking. Type in the chat and you can type into the uh, server. So you can actually communicate with people on the server from here. So see, it'll come up as your name and then it'll be green on the server. So you can zoom in. It's a uh, one pixel is one block, so as you can see, it's just one block, so very high resolution map. You can see anywhere that you want, so like here's spawn, as you can see. A uh, little arrow on the side over here, these are the players that are currently logged on. These are uh, the different worlds that are available for it. Um, so we have the nether, surface, and uh, flat. The are uh, different renders you can have for them. So for let's go ahead and for world, I don't know if the render is complete yet. Nope, nope, there we go. 
you can have the surface render, which does this little like 3D thing so you can see the, it's a topographic map is essentially what it is. So you can see what it looks like at an angle. And then the cave render shows all the different caves in the world. So yeah. So uh, go ahead and have fun with this map. It will always be up as long as the server is up. Uh, communicate with your friends. That's really high resolution. Wow. Look at that. I did not notice that. Wow. Looks like someone's been branch mining here. But uh, yeah, so that's the map, the different features of Dynamap. Uh, talk to people on the server and all that different fun stuff. Have fun exploring all the new biomes and... Uh, if there, there is going to be a couple problems for the first few days because it is still a dev build, but uh, hope you guys enjoy, and yeah.